Hi there, um, it's me again, and, um, it's time for more songs from the album show. Today's song is, um, Pop Goes the Weasel. Now, before I start, uh, you know, um, sorry it's been a long time since I've uploaded a video. Um, you know, for the past few, yeah, weeks, um, I was sick, and I constantly coughing and couldn't breathe, and, and, you know, couldn't sneeze or burp, and, you know, and all that jazz, yeah. Now, thanks to the steam breathing machine, I can now breathe again, you know, and cough and sneeze, and, no, uh, I know mean, what I mean, and, you know, a burp and sneeze. Yeah, also, um, I'm not gonna show that Easter egg from the, you know, um, Alvin intro in this video, um, <coughs> but, um, but, um, I'll show it, um, in, um, another video. So, um, um, yeah, um, um, uh, yeah, I'm finally back, and, uh, and, uh, yeah, there was some stuff I forgot to mention, yeah, in two previous videos I said I was gonna talk about, but didn't <coughs> talk about, yeah, which were Cookie Monster and the, and, you know, my favorites playlist, but I'll talk about them at the end of the video. Now, without further ado, um, here's Pop Goes the Weasel, with special guest star Sam Merlin. Enjoy. Also, um, yeah, um, the reason why we're redoing this one is because, uh, yeah, the original didn't turn out very well, so I'm redoing it. Same way with the magic show. Sorry. It's a bat. Chemistry set like Wiley Coyote. You like magic, Sonny? There he is. Jeez, he's huge. Also, yeah, um, <coughs> yeah, yeah, so I may forgot to mention when, yo, know, um, Peppy showed up at the very end of, uh, Dog Pounded, um, he's huge, like, 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 my God, uh, yeah, um, he's almost the same, so, <coughs> the same size as, uh, as Sylvester. I'll talk more about that at the end of the video. To help his face. They will make your eyes pop. Uh, the volume's at 40, by the way. Phenomenal. Will it, Phenomenal? Really work? Will it work? He looks just like Frankenstein. Sorry. My grandpa's dumb, Jim. Now observe closely. And a skeleton. First, we take the magic wand and... Pop! Yeah, loves it! Next, the magic clock. <laughs> His face when he said, Illusion! Yeah, it's working! Working, yeah. Yo, good thing, good thing I upload, um, you know, offload, offload those, those apps I don't use anymore. Yeah, I get it off screen, by the way. Now I can film more. What? <laughs> oh no. Stop! Stop! Marlin! Stop! 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 Here's my favorite part. You and Simon and Theodore sing it, and you kids at home do the pops. Go! Die. <laughs> Pop goes the weasel. <laughs> Pop goes the weasel. Round and round, the mulberry bush. The monkey chased the weasel. The monkey thought it was a joke. Penny for sport threat, penny for needle, that's the way the money goes. <coughs> Sorry. Goes the weasel. You wish to buy magic kit? <laughs> How about you? No! 
<laughs> oh my god. <laughs> um, yeah, that was the um Alvin Show song, The Pop Goes the Weasel. Uh, the weasel. Now, um, in case you're wondering where that gag came from, where it was like, no! <laughs> it came from the Tones and Friends season 7 episode, um, you know, Pop Goes the Wee, uh, no, I know I mean, uh, uh, the, um, t Thomas in the Search for Fergus, or Fergus Breaks the Wolves, um, you know, in the UK, even though he didn't break them. I also made a popular pure version of that song, uh, which, um, if you check out my, uh, yeah, Wile E. Coyote, um, yeah, uh, episode recording of Ray Said Zoom, uh, you can hear me sing it, yeah, but here I won't sing it. And, um, um, you know, what's really interesting is that, you know, that they actually made a song based on this episode, and it not only just tells a story, <coughs> you know, but brings it to life. And um, in addition to the kids, it's also sung by Michael Donnell, um, who produced most of the music for seasons one to seven. Yeah, and you know, sorry about my finger there. Yeah. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, I often drink water after this recording. Anyway, um, uh, and then, um, uh, um, you know, him and his, you know, friend, you know, um, you know, Junior Cam Bell would do the music for seasons one through seven. And, you know, and, you know, and, you know, um, I like the part when Fergus first enters the, Yo, <coughs> of the smelter's yard, and um, to yo, and then Ari and Bert um, you show up, yeah, and then they're like, "Hello, you know, are, are you happy to be here?" No, shrieked um, you know, shrieked um, the Fergus, and I love that old shit look on his face. <coughs> By the way, anyways, the song goes like this. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, uh, the ones was an age you ran away, just up and went, ran away, ran away, sat up, center, and down the line, Doo -doo. farewell, goodbye, wheel. And, uh, um, and, uh, uh, yeah, uh, he over the way good old Diesel say, you was hanging for a scrap, you're any day, you didn't want to wait for the fateful day, so the old engine ran away. And, uh, and, uh, yeah, um, yes, they pucked, sweet as third train, except they shot so firebox burning, slipped his bike, and he was on his way. Choo choo, farewell, goodbye. And so little then, she ran away, the stuff and went, ran away, ran away, didn't feel part of the railway. So little then, she ran away. Do you, do, 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 <laughs> when the other engines heard he'd gone, they felt so sad. And <coughs> yeah, they felt so sad and knew that you'll, um, and knew that you'll, um, he had thought them. No matter what Diesel had to say, stop him, had. At the final sense, so he thought, and he thought, where could he, could he go? Some search high, the other search low. Where's he go? Where's he go? We gotta bring the little engine home, so they all went out to look around, far and wide, and up and down. But no matter where they searched, one, and I can't, sorry, I'm, I can't, but no matter where, and I can't, um, sorry about the, uh, yeah, um, uh, yeah, um, uh, yeah, um, uh, yeah, um, story. And, uh, uh, yeah, but no matter where they, but no matter where they search, no one seemed to know oh, where did the little dungeon go. Thomas finally tracked him down. He was cold and weak, and all alone. <coughs> and, uh, yeah, uh, they told him, yeah, um, um, yeah, I told him, yeah, um, he was needed back urgently. You know, I'm <coughs> 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 sorry, urgently, and uh, uh, yeah. Uh, who, me? Really? Yes, you, you silly engine. Cause he's the pride of the railway. Dunner? 
<laughs> yeah, Turner, Silly Hunty, Puck, Sweet Star Tree, Chuck the Chutsu, Firebox Burn, he slipped his brake and he was on his way. Choo choo, hip hip, hooray! And so the old man she's heading home. The shoots in, cheers, hear the whistles blow. Cause now he's the fighter, the whale. Look at me, buddy. Here comes Fergus. Hooray! Dun, yes, the little dentist's coming home. Dun. <coughs> yeah, that's how it goes. Yeah, yeah. Now about Cookie Monster. Um, yeah, yeah. Um, he's a Sesame Street character that was created by Jim Henson. He's voiced by. <coughs> you know, uh, he's voiced by, I think, um, um, I forget his name. I'll look at, uh, I'll tell you, I'll look it up after this in corny. And uh, he loves the cookies. Yeah, and, you know, um, here's a fun bit of trivia. Back in season one, yeah, um, you know, Cookie Monster would, <coughs> yeah, uh, would eat rice cakes shaped just like cookies. It was to protect the puppet's fur from the oil on the cookies. And of course they would use, um, yeah, um, yeah, regular cookies in the later seasons. Yeah, but, um, um, yeah, um, but still kept the, kept the cookies oil free just to protect the puppet's fur. Yeah, and so, um, yeah, it's really interesting. Yeah, and Cookie Monster, yeah, would always eat a cookie like this. Cookie! <laughs> yeah. <coughs> now, about my favorites. Now, uh, for those of you who don't know, uh, yeah, um, these playlists are where I, um, uh, you know, uh, where I take, you know, a uh, certain videos, you know, uh, that I loved watching. Yeah, it puts them together in a play was so I can watch them over and over again anytime I want. Yeah, <coughs> yeah. Um, sometimes if I find videos that don't advance the playlist, yeah, and will advance another playlist, yeah, I take them out of that playlist and put them in the other. And so, I, 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 um, you know, but this series will never stop. I'll just keep going and going and going and going. So, yeah, um, yeah, um, that's pretty much it for this, you know, this video. So, I, I um, this is Blake saying, um, yeah, thanks for watching my video. I, I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope to see you again for more songs from that. Let's show you. Oh, we play the ending one more time. So, uh, hang on. Hey, also, um, <coughs> yeah, I'll talk about the, mon um, yeah, uh, the monsters in the, um, to, in the next video. Because <coughs> I don't have time for that right now. Sorry. Hey, hey, I think I'll start it. Yeah. <coughs> Plus, this song is also a reference to the Thomas episode Pop Goes the Beezer. <coughs> Goes the Weasel. So, until next time, that's all, folks. How about you? No!